A battle over gun laws during the 2023 legislative session. Today, Democrats push for reform while the Virginia Citizens Defense League plans to rally on Monday for Lobby Day. Henry Graff shows us what both sides are hoping to accomplish in Richmond. Inside the Virginia State House, polarizing ideas are emerging on how to keep communities safe. Democrats are hoping to block Republicans from rolling back gun laws like Virginia's red flag law. They also want to close loopholes that allow people barred from owning a gun from buying them. This is something that we can't afford to close our eyes to and adults are the ones who are responsible for keeping guns out of the hands of children and teens. State Senator Jennifer Boisco has a bill that would require gun owners who have children under the age of 18 to lock them up. Not one size doesn't fit all, and that's the problem with this. It's a one size fits all bill, and we're going to oppose it. The Virginia Citizens Defense League is backing a number of bills, too. They want a permitless concealed carry law along with undoing local gun control. In Richmond City Council banned guns from parks. They are also not allowed at the state capitol complex. One of our top things will be, of course, not to add any more gun control to Virginia. We need to repeal some of it. Many of these bills still have to make their way through committees. And with Democrats in control of the Senate and Republicans in control of the House, that shared power means the needle on this issue may not move. We've seen over the past several years a serious increase in suicidality with our teens. And also, gun violence has taken over as the number one uh, reason that children have died in the Commonwealth. 